welcome to the Jack Jack and Pat Pat Gamer's Den. That's right, Gamer's Den. Like show again. And today we are going to be playing a very fun game. Um, oh, that's over here. <laughs> a very fun game called Flashpoint. The Flashpoint. We got the. We got the. Oops. There we go. Flashpoint. We got. We got the Mac recording over here to give us a different perspective. For you guys. Flashpoint. This For is a fun guys. game. This is a cooperative game. Uh, You're like, fighting against the game, which if I would like to show how you basically win and lose and stuff, Dad. Okay. Like the concept. Well, okay. the concept is a house is getting on fire. <laughs> it'd be yeah, cool if, you know, it'd be cool if there's an effect down here like, now, a fire. Okay. It would be cool. Um, the turn sequence. Here, I'll hold this. I'll hold this I up over here. This, yeah, the turn sequence is first. That's this one, right? Yeah. Yeah, you get the action phase. Then you get a ride fire, it's yes. advanced fire. And then if you got one of uh, these doohickeys. These little doohickeys are called POIs or point of interest. Those, some of those. It could be a person you've just rescued or it could be blank. If you have recovered one of those, then you have to replenish it. And how you win the game is you get seven of the people, and how you defeat, four of them die. Now, blank ones, if they die, they don't count against you. Right, you have to, four victims have to die. Four with in order people, for you to lose cats, the game. or dogs. Right, four victims have to die in order for you to lose the game. Now, uh, because we haven't set up the board yet... Well, hold on, let's start off with the turn sequence so that they can understand it. The turn sequence starts with the action phase. Four actions per turn. Okay, now this, this runs through for each player, so on my turn I get an action four. phase. I've got four action points. There's a special card that they provide here... here. Mm -hmm. To tell you what you, know you that? can do. That tells you what you can do, like for one action point you can move. Um, moving through a fire to cost two action points. Uh, extinguishing smoke costs one action point. Extinguishing a fire costs one action point to move it to smoke or two action points to clear it out. Um, then there's a few other things like you can uh, oh, you man, can chop through a wall. Um, what you don't want to do. Well, that Unless depends. Unless you really have to. That depends. A chop costs two action points. And anyway, they get a but, nice little handy reference to tell you. How many action points each thing costs? Well, you get four I, action points I'll per turn. I was going to tell you guys also one way to lose. You lose enough of these black doodads. Not sure if they can see well. The little black doodad pile here. Ooh. Those are how many the buildings have now. If, all, my of, dude. if all those black things are gone, game over. Right. That basically means you, the house comes down. It basically means you've lost the structural integrity of the house, and the fire has won, and you have lost. No, Flashpoint has won. And if you're playing, we are playing the, I think it's called second edition or revised edition, and you get little funky, cool little fire dudes instead of, you know, just little tokens. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, and they actually give you the tokens that you can use for other stuff if you want to. Just in case if you do want to play that little version. Right. We are going to be playing the family game version. It's also kind of the introduction version. It's a little bit easier to play overall. Because we did try the other version. Oh, it was hard. But realistically, the reason why we're going to be playing the family game version is the... It takes shorter. It, it, the uh, experience game um, really needs like four players. I mean, I know they say it can play with two or three, I think, but it really needs like four players. And those four players will be, yeah, it says two to six. Those four players, uh, or more, really help propel the game. You need somebody to kind of man the fire truck, and he's shooting the hose as well as you got to watch out for the hazards and chain reactions. And There's a lot to it, and it's, it's very It's better difficult. you just have, like, four people. But with two players, it's much easier to play the family game version or the introductory version, and that's what we're going to be playing today. Okay, so now, let's, should we start setting up? Well, that was moving. Then we got to advance the fire. What we do is we roll the die. We roll the dice. You roll the dice. I'm just going to roll it for example. You, um, have, you have an eight-sided and a six-sided die. I have a five, six, so you look for five, There's, five. The eight-sided numbers are on one side. The six-sided um, numbers are on another six. side. 
and see fire rolls right there. But if there's a smoke, that turns into fire. But if there's a fire. Oh. It right. You mark the grid. You go there. If it's blank, what do you put? A smoke. And if there's smoke, you put a fire. And if there's fire, it starts to spread. Right. There's a chain reaction that spreads uh, the fire. Um, they actually and have a name for it, right? I think it's an. I think it's called chain explosion. reaction. They explosion. They have an. We have an explosion that occurs. Um, so. We don't want those. Those are bad. Definitely. Then we mentioned replenish it. The last phase for each player is replenish the point of interest or POI. Same idea. You just those roll, are those blue question marks. You roll the die and, and place them wherever. Now here's the thing. If there's already a fire in that spot, the fire goes off and you place the dude in. Right. That's one also cool thing that I like. It's like the, you put out the fire, then you put the dude in. The game wins when at the end of, at any point we have saved seven or more victims have been rescued. Um, the game is lost if the building collapses. That's when we use all of these, all damage markers are placed. Um, or we lose four victims. This is what I don't fire. understand. Why four? Why not like seven as well? Because when we start the game, it tells us somewhere in here to start off with like 11 or 10 victims. Yeah, 10 victims. We start with 10 victims. So if we need to save at least seven, seven plus three is 10. If we lose four, we can't possibly save seven uh, PLIs. So 10? That's correct. Um, yep. And then of course, once you get to a point of interest, Say there was one here. Uh, let's say it's a bird. Okay, say there's one here. And I, I do my little dude over to here. I then flip to find out if I got a person. I've now got to move with a person. Now that, if, I can, if I'm correct, counts zero move actions. To, to flip it counts zero actions, correct. But However, to move it, it takes two. Right, it's two now. Two action points each. Once they're out here, they're safe. Now that's in the family game and version. And that's when it goes over here. In the non-family game version, you actually got to get them to the ambulance. Now, we're going to go ahead and that pretty much gives us the general gist. You're going to get more of it as we actually play. And uh, we're going to go ahead and actually go through the setup so you guys can understand. They give you some cool instructions on how to set up. They also give you a quick setup. They give you the quick, neat setup thing. Uh, very much like Pandemic does. In fact, if you've played Pandemic, this is a, basically like Pandemic for firefighters um, with a few extra little twists that kind of make it unique. They're not going all around the world. Okay, so family game setup number one, place the board in the center of the table. We've done that. Mm -hmm. Place the door markers with the doors closed. Doors closed is that Good side. Luck. Doors opened is that side. So we're going to place the door markers on the doors with, with them closed. With the two blocks, basically. All these two blocks right there that you see. Is that it? No, there's, two, there's three more right here. We don't have enough door markers. We lost one. No. Oh, wait. Right. Closed. No, I don't think we... I accidentally put one right there. So there we go. We have enough. one right there. Oh, it was, they were just automatically open? Yeah, remember? No, I don't. I forgot. Look yes, those that. are. Because that's, that's where you start. I still thought we had a kick in the door there. No. See? Yep, you're right. My bad. All right. See, that's what's great about the, the handy-dandy graph side. Let's me know that I was wrong and Jack-Jack was right. Guys, did you actually hear it? He admitted I was right for once! Okay. Mark your calendars! <laughs> okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, now we're gonna place the fire markers. Because we're playing the family game, these fire markers are in specific spots. It's actually easier to look at the map. Okay, so where? So, um, now we these get, are already fire. We get three, yeah, three there. Because that's then where the fire is those began. And three here. Is that any, these areas are where the fire began? And then these three over here. Is that it? Yep. Because these are where the fire begun already. Right. This is where this is the initial set when the firefighters arrive at the house. Uh, well, let's do it. Remove two victim yes. markers, one false alarm marker, and place. Okay, so we got You got You need ten victims and five false alarms. False alarms are the blue question marks that are blank on the other side. One, two, three, four. How many? We need uh, ten victims and five false alarms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and five false alarms. And five false alarms. One, two, three, four, five, one, two. Okay, one more victim. That should leave uh, two victims and one false alarm to be put back in the box. I'm not even going to 
shuffle them so I don't put all the victims in the first section. Shuffle them. Shuffle them. Okay, which one's the victim, guys? All right. <laughs> now, we need to place three victims onto the game board to start. We've got one in this corner here. That's where I'm going. One over here. That, that. And one on the bathroom. Wait, wait, wait. They're both on the toilet. I have to take, I have to go to the bathroom. Oh, okay, I'll buy them. Here, let me, let me take a uh, little picture with my, my IP phone. So for all of you who are watching, they're sitting on the toilet, you guys. They had to go to the bathroom and then the mic. Okay, here's a close-up kind of of the board in general, the initial setup. And we can come down here. We can see, as you can see, this one is really on the toilet. We weren't kidding. Oops, I'm moving to the wrong one. There's this, this room is a hot spot. There's another point of interest hiding over here by the table. The room in the center is kind of hot. Another point of interest. He's hiding. actually on the table. He's actually on the toilet as he, well. He's also on the toilet hiding, and then we got another hot spot. So you can I see think, I think the hot on... spots kind of move through the center of the board. I thought that I thought you needed to go to the bathroom, but guys, I know where this all started. Oven was on. Oh, did, did I? The, did that save? Did I mess it up? The oven, guys. The oven was on. The oven spread the fire. So never leave your guys' ovens on when you guys go out to eat. It starts fires. Or microwave. No, not microwave. Oven. Yeah, I was correct. Okay, guys. So when you go out to eat, never leave, leave your microwaves on. Okay. Or we'll cause this fire. Or this will happen to your Now, we'll place the damage markers. Those, that's these guys. The action points. The action points are the little green dudes. Which, right here. So, if you, like, you don't use all your four, you can, you can save up to up. one. You can save up to four action points for the next turn. Up to one. So, you could actually have eight action points for one turn. Um, and the remaining POIs uh, within range. Uh, each player takes a card. We didn't, we're not playing with the cards right now. Oh, we take, I'm sorry. We take these cards. They got cool little identity cards. So you know you're blue. Or in yeah. this case, he's, he's orange. Because orange is my favorite color. If you play the experience game, you also can pick a uh, experienced firefighter, which will give you um, extra abilities just like the people in Pandemic. Or just give you more action points. We are not playing with the hazmats, the hot spots, and the ambulance or the fire truck. Each player plays their firefighter near a space on the board. So I'm going, right here so I can I'm going to start over here go so over that there. I can quickly get to him. I'm going We're going to start here, quickly get to them. And then we collectively decide and who goes first. And on the toilet. You can go pooping while, he's, while we can't go to the fire. Ooh, I need to go into the back. And we keep the rules in a handy spot in case we need them again. Okay, so I guess we'll go ahead and let James go first. Well, I have four action points. One, two, three, four. Got a victim! Woohoo! All right, so James has already found a victim. Now we need to roll to advance the fire. Please be a good spot. Please be a good spot. Five, two. So we go to five. Right here. And then right the two. Here. And we play smoke. Place smoke. First time we played this game, we placed fire instead of smoke. Oh, we lost. We lost quick, fast, and hard. <laughs> place smoke if it's empty. All right, we don't need to replenish a POI, so now it is my turn. I have four action points. You can I'm going to go in the door. One, two. Open the door. Three to kick in the door. It costs an action to kick in the door. Then try to get four. Hi, dude. Why are you on the toilet? I pooped. Okay. <laughs> it was supposed to be a two. Okay, so we got a one, four. Boy, talk about that. It's right in the room, just like the one that you have right in your room. This one's right in my room. Yeah, well, I'm gonna forget about that right now. So All right, now James is gonna one, move. One, two, three, four. Notice that it costs two action points to move with a victim. So next turn, unless I get on fire, next turn. Yeah, it's not good if a firefighter catches on fire. I mean, that can actually happen in the game. You get incapacitated, um, and that's not very good. One five. One five. So one five. Right next to me. <laughs> right next to where I just did one four. See? Dude, go with me. It's safer. That was supposed to be a joke. <laughs> okay. So, now I get four action points, so one, I will flip. It's a false alarm. It's a false alarm. Mine's actually 
actually a girl. I have so actually, that was. I have a girl, guys. I have a girl. Okay, so I that was one. Um, I'm two. gonna go two to here, three to clear, four to open the door. So we can start getting some fires out. So we got that. We got that one cleared out. <laughs> we we'll beat you, smoke. But the we'll fire's roaring. Okay, now we roll to see where the fire goes. <coughs> Six, four, here. Wow. Ooh, that right. was close. That was close to the door. It, it destroyed the piano. Sorry, guys. Piano's on. Oh, no, no, no. That's just smoke. It may not destroy the piano. All right. One, two, three, four. Yes. You yes. got our first victim, guys. We saved the victim. We are awesome. Nothing's blowing up. Boom. I didn't mean that. <laughs> Nothing's okay. exploding. Okay, that's the fire. Commercial. Okay, I'm buddy. 6-2. 6-2. <laughs> Close. I can this, room, back. this room is flaring up. You don't need to yell. This room is flaring up. Alright, so it's my turn. I have four action points. Go into the room or get the smoke thing. Go into the room. Oh, you know what we didn't do? We didn't even follow the rules. I got a roll to put back a 2-7. Here to put a POI. Oh, I forgot to do that as well. Right, now it's your turn. I forgot to do that as well. That at the end of my last turn. Four, three. So four, three. That's close. That one's in trouble. I'm, I can go after him. Can you see that? I can go after can it. That? Yeah, that's going to be your job. Okay, so I got four actions. I got one, two, three, four, and I'm going to flip to find out I have another false alarm. Ah. Great, Dad. Let's put them like right here in the middle, so we so, don't get confused with this. Now, next action point is advance the fire. Uh, one, three. That's oh. smoke. Oh, but you know what? That won't be smoke, will it? Yeah. Now, if the smoke's next to a fire, it might even be turned into a fire. If the smoke is next to a fire, it automatically ignites into a fire. In this case, hold on. Let's go ahead and pull this out so we can we can show them. Up close and virtual. See, that smoke is right next to a fire, therefore that will ignite. Go ahead and flip it over. And become a fire. So, then meanwhile you see I'm over here trying to save the world. You're trying to sleep! Save the house. You're trying to sleep. And here's James over here outside of the house. Spread the fire. Now we I gotta replenish the POI. I'm going five. to one five. Which, it's right near smoke, which No, one five is a smoke. The smoke will be removed to put that in there. I'm going after him now. See if it's another yep, fire. I might as well go after him. One, gonna... two, three. Wait, but if I do that, the fire could go in. Four to open. Four. Or you can hold the action point and not open the door yet. I'm holding the action point. See? The reason why you'd want to do that, uh, why wouldn't you want to open the door immediately, is because if the fire chain reacts, it'll blow open the door instead of having it going through an open door and getting the firefighter. Guys, look, I see this. Or, it, it, sorry, explode. I have now five turns to my next turn. Five yeah, you're going to have five action points on his next turn. Now, roll for the fire. One, two. So that's way up there. Woo. That's another one that's going to be smoke, which is immediately going to turn to fire. No. no. One, two. You got the wrong one. Which will immediately turn to fire. Fortunately, we haven't had any explosions, though. Now, oh, my. Uh, my turn. I got four actions. One, two, three, flip. Oh, it's actually a victim. Wait, but you I only have one action point left, so unless, give me a free you leave, unless you leave the victim, which is not really a good no, idea. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and save my action point. So that's um, my turn, right? No, I gotta. Oh yeah, fire. sorry. Now, for the fire, it's in two, three, bang! We have an explosion. No. Remember so how this works? It goes. We fall the arrows. Wait, that no, no, no. Right? That's that's for it has max the. Okay, so an explosion, it was like a pandemic spreading out, right? So we got to put a fire there, fire here, 
This door is now going to be blown out. No! And this chain reacts to here, and we get a black damage marker. No! Hey, do, hey, Dad, do you want a cup of coffee? <laughs> That's supposed to be a joke. Okay, so that was the. I don't have a POI to replace because all three of them are on the board. It is now your turn. I got you five. Now have five actions because you held one. One, two, three. That's right. Two, three will clear that fire. Four, five. And then you can flip that for free. Is it a person? Yep. It's a boy. I gotta save a person. <laughs> I'm not I can't get in that camera. What camera? Yeah, it's kind of hard. We won't do that again. What? Uh, no, I don't bother. <laughs> All right, so now roll for the fire. And hope you don't hit any of that patch in the middle. Or I'm dying. Well, it depends on which one you hit, but. Six. Six, six is basically all. Three? Did yep. you say six, three? That's right here. Three, guys! Hey, it's still smoke. It's still smoke. Yeah, okay. because this doesn't cause it to be fire. Right. Unless this one was down, then that would have been fire. All right, so now it's my turn, so I'm moving with a victim. And yeah, five One, turn. two, three, four. I'm going to keep holding this action because I am carrying a victim. And you don't want to leave a victim. Now through. for the fire. Two. Three. So two, three. Oh wow, that's the same one. We have to hit that again. Wall. Okay. Wall. Hold on. This goes here to here. So, but that's an open door, right? Yeah. So that that doesn't take a damage marker. No. Good. Uh, this goes this way to here. We take another damage marker. Which, if two damage markers are on the wall, the wall's completely down. Wall's completely that down. That means this smoke. This is goes still this smoke. way, and now we have our first wall down. There's two damage markers right here. This goes this way because this door is already blown out. Goes all the way and creates a fire right here. I need to get this person out of here. You need to get them out of there fast. Well, let's see. One, two, three, four. I can get it right here. In now, time. here's where an, an advantage can come in with more players than just two because those players can be focusing on the fire. Let's say two players are focusing on clearing the fire while two players are focusing on getting the victims. And in the advanced game, you probably want even more than that because then you can have one manning the fire truck that has this giant hose that blows out lots oh, of stuff. Yeah. That's really helpful. But you also got to watch out for chemical spills and all kinds of other stuff. All so, of this. So that was that was stuff. the that was the fire. Um, we are not doing the um, POI because we haven't gotten anybody out. It now goes to your turn. Man, I thought it was just my turn. No, that was my turn. One, two, three, four. Yep. Roll for fire. Please have in the same spot. That's heating up. Please don't do the fire. Please don't do the fire. Four, seven. Seven, four, which is here. That will be a smoke. Woohoo, smoke. Yeah, but it's on the chess table. By the Eat. way, smoking is bad. You really shouldn't smoke. <laughs> okay. So now you're gonna now you're gonna go ahead and roll for the fire. Oh, we did. Oh, we did roll for the fire. I'm sorry. <laughs> we don't do a POI. My turn. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. It's my you can turn. Get a VI, you can get a POI. I P still have. O yep, and I have I extra. Out. So POI. One, two, three, four. We Woo rescue another victim. That's two victims rescued. Out of seven. I'm gonna to use my extra action point to head back into the building. I guess I'll just keep this one right here. And now, I've got to roll for the fire. Five, four, please. Five, please, four, please, five, please. five, four, right where you are. Good thing it's a smoke. It's a smoke, right. If it was fire, we'd be in trouble. Yeah, I'll be dead and so would the victim. Right, okay. No if you're I now roll for a POI. No matter if you're carrying a victim, if you're carrying a victim or a victim, no matter if you... With five, a two. Right there, close to me. Guys, Ooh. guys, if let's say like how I have a smoke, if that switches to fire, I die, and also the POI dies. Well, you don't die. The P the POI does die, but you get incapacitated. You're you're moved out of the. You immediately move out of the building. Yeah. But you lose the ability to rescue that victim. So. That, now it's your turn, right? No, your turn. I just finished my turn. One, two, three. Right, you gotta remove it. And then you're going to have to I'm saving. I'm saving. And hold an action. Right. Now, I, 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 I'm, I'm, not, I'm not taking a risk of leaving the PRI. 
right. Eight, six, right here, right here in the corner. Look, I need to get out of here. Someone help me. Be careful, you're shaking the table too much. Someone help me. Okay, so that makes I'm it going to my turn. I got one, two, flip this. It's a cat. It's a kitty cat. Okay, so that cost me two actions to get into here. I felt like a dog didn't have three, to Three, four to go to head, start heading back out. Um, now for cool. the fire. Uh, two, seven, smoke. We get smoke. Hey, if you run out of fire tickets, you lose? I don't know. I don't think so. I think there's enough fire tokens to cover the entire board. Oh, uh, basically, we would have won. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait, why am I rolling? It's my turn. Nine. Two, why am I rolling? It's my Right? Because now it's my turn, right? And you just roll. Dad, can I go? Dad, I'm going. I'm oh, going. No, maybe not. There's 27. I'm going. I don't know. Go ahead. One, two, three, four. Woohoo! Yes. We saved a, mo a guy in a tuxedo. What are you doing in the kitchen at this time of day? Yeah. You're supposed to be working. Now I'm going to use my extra point to get back in. Never know when you want one. Okay. Never know. Back in and roll for the fire. Please have a peep. Oh, if it's back at that area, we're going to be in trouble. Uh, well, we got to do what you got to do. One. One's pretty clear. Three. One, three is the only place that's not clear. All right, so we're gonna get it. We start here. We explode. So we get a fire there. No. We get a fire here. This door is already out. Huge. And this goes all the way and puts a block, a damage marker right there. Guys, look. This room's almost completely totally engulfed. Yeah. We really, really would be helpful if we had more players. Where are you? Why aren't you here? The place is going up. Okay, so that was the fire. Roll for a POI. We gotta put another POI back. Why would you miss that one spot? Well, that would be very bad. Two six. Uh, two six is right where I am. I don't. I don't know that you can do that. I don't, I don't think you can do that. <laughs> Wait, no, that's too far. Uh -oh. I don't think you can do that. I thought you can. I don't think so. If the target space has a fire smoke, remove that. If the target space has a firefighter, immediately reveal, flip it over. Oh, oh so there you go, it immediately reveals. <laughs> Alright, look at that. That's cool. You're getting two people now. Look at that, I learned something new in this game. Alright, so now that was now it's my turn. One, two, three, four. We get the cat out. That's and then you can four. come back into the get the clue. Okay. That's four rescued victims. One, two, and then you can get her right next to the door. That's right. I rolled a five, four. This turns to fire, causes that to turn to fire because it's adjacent, smoke adjacent to a fire. I got a POI out, so I roll for another one. We're gonna go to six, three, right on top of you. Wait, that means we reveal it. We reveal it right away. Oh, it's a false alarm. Oh, oh. <laughs> This way down to him. Yeah. I'm obviously gonna catch her, get her out, and then. Wait, guys, three more. We win the game. Right. Well, you're and gonna head to that more. one. Oh wait, 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 wait. It immediately revealed as a false alarm. I think we do it again. <laughs> no, at the end of your turn, I think we do it. Uh, remove if it's a false alarm. If the target space has. Oh, guys, we have six more people okay. left. So yes, on your turn, you're gonna place another one. There's two more false alarms and four more people. You know, we might be doing that wrong. You might actually be able to place it again, but I, I don't know for sure. So. We, we're, we're we'll ready. do it on your turn. We'll do it on your turn to be fair. So it's your turn. You got four actions. Are you sure? I thought that was you that I thought. I, I just could. rolled for the POI. I just went out, rolled the fire, and the POI. And then, okay. One, two, three, four. Good. So I'm going to head roll this way. Fire. Yep, roll for fire. So I'm going to head that way, Dad, so. 
Please have you near me. Six, Six three. Six, three. Smoke right there. It's a good thing you removed that, otherwise this all would have turned into fire. And, and that turned into now fire. Now roll for a POI. Wait if it's like right on top of you again. Three um, six. Three six. Hey, wait, right no, three eight. Three eight. Three eight. Three eight. Three eight's right here. I accidentally said that wrong. All right. All right, my Guys, turn. Get out of the house. Here I come. Here I come. Oops. <laughs> You'll notice that I'm on top of her instead of carrying her over my shoulder like the typical firefighter would do. You're standing. I am standing on her ah! and using her as a skateboard instead. <laughs> da, 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 da. That's the way to get out of a burning building. Just put the victim on the ground and jump on top of them and go like you're tobogganing. Okay! <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually hurt. Okay, I'm hurt. Okay, this is for the fire. Four. Three. Boom. So that will be not smoke, but actual fire. Guys, look! Do not be in the kitchen at this time period. Kitchens are not safe, guys. When there's a fire. Trust me. Wait, why am I running? I don't know, you got four actions. One, two, three. And I should save an action. Because if that ignites... I right, it. it'll hit you. So I should save one just in Yeah, two. that would be smarter. It'd be smarter to save your action. Now you can do one, two, three, see, four, five. Here, Get right let's, to him. Let's put this one on the iPhone so that we're nice and close so they can see what's going on. Do you guys see what's going on right now? Oops. <laughs> you just took a picture. It was hilarious. Okay, see what we have here is James has one more action. He could move into he could move to six six there and move into the room. However, if he does that, and that we roll 6-5 for the fire, it will explode. Or 7-5. Yeah, but 7-5 won't explode on you. Oh, yeah. Seven, five, yeah. So if he rolls a 6-5, it will explode and chain react into his space, causing him to be incapacitated and move out. <sighs> so it's wiser for him to save the action. Oop, your hand's like way in the thing. It's wiser for him to save the action until next turn and then enter. Well, I'm safer. Did y'all get that? Good. <laughs> it was kind of okay. funny. That was actually kind of funny. Okay. Now. So now you move. You got to do the fire. Moment of truth. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh. Seven, one. Seven, one. Smoke. Yes. Smoke. I just see you like on fire. Okay, so there's there's no POI to replace. Yes, there is. Why is there no POI? Why is there Oh no, there's three. I didn't miscount it. <laughs> I didn't count the girl I'm on top of. <laughs> okay, let me go ahead and make my moves. One, two. So we rescue. That's five saved. Three more. Five. Wins. Five. That's five. Five. Okay, that was one, two, three. Three, and I'm going to clear the smoke out. Four. Woohoo, guys! We're saving the world! And this was another case where it makes more sense to take out the smoke than move into a potentially spot that could cause me a problem. Now, Fire. Five. Three. That, oh, that's a bad spot. Mm. Because it's smoke, but it immediately turns to fire and turns all of those to fire. The whole house on fire, guys. I've got to roll for a POI. Five, seven. This comes out. Want me to get him instead? Well, you might as well. It's the closest one. <laughs> and then go on the one that's saw the toilet. Actually, what may be smarter here is because we have a lot of damage tokens, it may be smarter to come in to here and break out the wall. Or break this wall. Or break, yeah, break out one of these walls. That way you can get in and out quickly with these POIs. Because we have enough right now. So right. we can do that? If we were having a lot more explosions, and when you play the full game, the uh, oh. experience game, you get a lot more, um, you'd be using up these damage tokens pretty fast. You probably wouldn't want to chop down a wall. But in the family game... You want to! You can! That's right! You can do it! You can do it for 1995! Well, I don't know where that what came was, from. What was that old Handy Mandy? We, yes, we can do Yes, we can! Is that what it is? Handy Mandy? I thought that was Bob the Builder. 
Oh, is that Bob? That's right. We can Bob, build it. We okay. can build. Well, we're not building. Yes, we are. We're keeping this place so non-fired, falling down. Okay, then you come into here. That's what all this while I get done. Yeah, I want the. I would like to have um, <laughs> Superman's breath, <laughs> and the fire will all go out. All right, so that. Did be no game? Did I roll for fire already? Yes. And right, and I put the POI in, so now it's your turn. One, two, three. That was safer. Yeah, that's fine. That's just uh, you break the wall. Then you can do wall. four, five, and pick up. No. Numbers. Oh yeah, four, five. That's right. See. Tom false alarm. Uh, Tom another on. false alarm. Well, now you're gonna go for that guy, right? And then you break the wall. Well, yeah. we don't. We've gotten four false alarms, and there's only five in the so thing. So there's one more. There's only one more. I can right. break. I can break fire. this wall, and then I go out right there. You can just break out this wall. Or this wall. So then, Either way. I, so then I can get into him and bring him out. Well, I'm on my way here. This is a door. I'm on my way here, so. You then you take that. that one out, and I'll break that wall. All right, go ahead and roll for the fire. But guys, we almost went. We almost won. Yeah. Unless, almost. unless one of those are a false alarm. <laughs> but we're potentially gonna have an explosion. Six, five. Yes, it's smoke, and it's the diagonal. Don't count. It's gotta be. It's no, gotta it's be that just, way. no, no. It's a diagonal. Joke. Okay, um, POI, because you found a false alarm. I'm just like right on top of me. Oh, that would suck. <laughs> Why? <laughs> no, no, right on top of you is good. I, I'm sorry, I was thinking fire. No, no. Yeah, fire, fire with fire, bad. <laughs> mm. Recognize Six. where that quote's from? No. Six. Two! Six, two, explodes. No. Yeah, six, two. This is a fire! <laughs> See, I got confused. Now, this one's a fire. Okay, so um, no, the um, the um, the um. Fire. <gasps> oh, 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 no, Transylvania. Fire, bad. No, uh, seriously. Fire, bad. Dad, Dad, hold on, Transylvania. That's we right. get it. Fire, bad. Yeah. No fireworks. No fire. No like. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go one, two, three. And four, I'm going to go ahead and open the door because we want to get to this this person. Oh, hold on, I got to roll. I don't want you to. Welcome to the five, two. So that's all the way over here. Five, two. We put smoke down. Sweet. Wait. Sweet. Not window. Window. Wall. That actually stinks. Right. Stand fire up. doesn't go through a wall unless it's totally blown out. Oh, what happens if this just like explode and destroy the whole house? That would be bad. Okay, now, James, your turn. One. Two to open the door. Two, three. Three to clear, that's very good. Then four, because there's and no really possible more fire. These happening. are two actual victims. There's not a false alarm here. We won the game, basically. We right, because you're going to move up, chop out the wall, and then come out, and I'm going to come into here and then head out this door, if. and we're going to have the game. So guys, we almost won the game unless one of those are a false alarm. B for victory. I don't get it. It's from there, the there's a, show. There's a, there was a show called V. There was. And it was good. And it took it off the air. Because of aliens! Bad ABC. They took um, Make It or Break It off the air. At least I think it was ABC. Yes, it was. I thought Bad it was. channel. Bad channel. Oh, I like to make Don't it. Don't even get me started on cancel shows. <laughs> Don't. Don't. Castle Jones! <laughs> Alright, my turn. Right, you spent the fire? Right, because you went there. Okay. So, one. Yes! yes! It's a person. I still want this to Two, three. And I'm going to hold an action. Do a little do that. Fire. I don't get like to do that. Two. One. Ouch. Okay. Yeah! This explodes, so we get a damage marker. Right here as yeah, well. We get that. We get a damage marker this way. And we then right a damage there. marker this way, and a damage marker this way. See how fast these can start sucking up? Guys, right, so break down the wall. Yes, because once, basically, we're about to win. About to win. 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 I don't get it. We're about to win the game. Ow. I don't get that. Oh, never mind. Win! 
I was trying to make a W. W. You blocked mine! Okay. Well, go ahead. Make your moves. Make your move. It's my turn already? One. Feel up. Yes! No, it's not. Because that was one. Do you, Dean? Feel lucky. Two, three. It was a person? Yeah. Okay, I hate to break it to you, but to chop down and put one damage block is two action points. So to do four damage blocks, you need four action I mean, to do two da one, damage blocks, you need two, four three. action points. Right, so you're going to hold an action. So I can do... You'll have it next turn. And I have one, and I'm going to have next turn. <laughs> We're going to win if the fire room somehow get to us. How can it get to me? I don't know. But you're in trouble. If it gets to us, we're in trouble. And you're I, in trouble. That I, now listen to me. Three, I've watched enough tabletop to four, see that you can be thinking you're winning and then find out you're losing. Three. Three, four. Three. Oh, great. Four. That's here, right? No, wait. Yes. Yeah, three, four is here. All right, so let's do it one, one direction at a time. This way gets a fire marker there. This way gets a damage token. This way gets damage token. Which means... And this way gets... No, that way... Nothing. It's already all filled up. Should I still use one damage token? Yeah, because, because I don't think we'll use all these, and we can still win the game. You see, once you're out, we win the game. Well, because I'm going to go get mine out, then once you get yours out... One, two, three, four. We win the game. Woohoo, guys! We basically win. win the game. But we, but we have to play till we get all seven out because something could go from Ralph until we win the game. You never know what could happen. The game could change. <laughs> all right, my turn. One, two. Save the victim. That's, save the, that's like save the citizen on sky high. One, two. Hey, wait, I got it. Wait, I, that was only one, two, right? Yeah. Three. And then I can use four and my extra action... To get me out. To get that, which will then open it up so you can get out on your turn. That's what you call teamwork. You do that in cooperative oh, games. Good. <laughs> Dad, at the end, he's like, Dad, go on to make the end. He's like, ah, well, yeah, no. Okay, five, five seven. seven, so we can smoke. Smoke. No, Ooh, it's man. a fire because fire made a fire. Okay. My turn. All right, it is now James's turn. See what? You gotta be careful. You're shaking this every time you. One, two, and we won! And Woo that's it! Ah. We win! We win! What? What? One, two, three, win. four, five, you six! Win. There's only six over here! What? <laughs> no, there's the, one, there's the one off the board there. Okay, okay, now we won! <laughs> you don't wanna give a Wait, you, you never place a POI! It didn't matter. We still were gonna win. <laughs> Alright, fine. Wait, 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 wait. He went, he went to five, six. Five, six, he went there. Okay, so let's see. Oh, what the It would have been the puppy dog. Bad luck, it was a false alarm. It would have been the puppy dog. This was our last false alarm, so we, I should have we never We won the game, though, clearly, though, because we, we actually didn't lose a victim. As, as tough as it was, as bad as the fire was spreading over here, we didn't actually lose a victim to the fire. Yeah. <laughs> we, like, rock, give it up. Whoa. Yeah. That's just how good we are. Yeah. Okay. So, um, guys, look. Hey, as you can tell, hold on. as you can tell, Last Point is a very fun and exciting game for the whole family. The whole family. The whole entire family. That's right. Last Point is awesome fun for the whole family. And we won. <laughs> right? Oh, you don't seem all excited. Maybe we should have lost. Oh, whoa, screaming! Wait, wait. Screaming! Wait, I'm wait, telling you. Why are you all excited? Okay. Oh, we won! 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 Yeah! We won! Was that good enough for you? Yeah, that was that was much better. What do you guys think? Was that good enough for you guys? <laughs> mentioned flashpoint awesome game we played the um, introductory we played the family version and well it doesn't tell us on here but I think we've got like the revised edition or something because you can see right here it tells you that you actually get the firefighters uh, game selection protected um. I don't know I think we have the revised or the second edition or something like that um, I, I don't see it on the in either case it's by this company 
indie uh, indie board, board and cards. They, they are the company that makes this game. Hey, we were all getting coffee. What happened? The fire <laughs> broke out. And, like the place <laughs> was burning down, dude. We saved the people. Wait, you got coffee? Yeah. No, 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 no. Whoa! See now you're now you're now you're, now you're doing too much. So. <laughs> you guys get burnt. So, we want to uh, thank. Indie board and cards for uh, letting us use this game and demo it and play it for demo our it? gamers den today. We also thank uh, Kevin Lansing for creating this wonderful game and giving us hours and hours of fun. Our family has enjoyed this game over and over again. Um, even when we lost, it's still fun. Just like Pandemic, when you lose, it's still fun. Flashpoint is fun even when you still lose. Of course, probably better, you know, winning because winning rocks, right? But we have lost before. And I have seen online twice. that they have um, like scenario, extra scenarios to add and extra maps you can add. And what's kind of neat, and we didn't show this, but we can do it now because we already won the game. Whoa! Woo! Is do? that this board is double sided? So this side's the uh, family introductory game, and then this side is the more expert. Uh, experience level game. Well, and, these, these. and when you play this side of the game, and when you play in experience mode, remember how we placed our fire tokens to start, just putting them based on the in, the start set. You actually roll to find out where the fire is. And there's um, these pieces as well. Right. There's added. an ambulance. A fire truck. There's a fire truck, as I mentioned, and this is cool because this has the fire truck hose that can like. It blows in and takes out like a whole sector of fire. Fire um, gun. These are ambulance-like markers. The, there's toxic chemicals. Uh, and hot spots. This makes hot spots, which ignite faster. Uh, chain reactions. All kinds of neat stuff that you know really takes this game to a whole other level. And you lose a lot. Yeah, and you lose a lot. Yeah. But we didn't lose. We won. Wait, where's the toilet? <laughs> Yeah, this is a different layout. It's not quite the same. Like the kitchen's over there, the bedroom's over there, bathroom's in the middle, oh. living room's over there. But you What's know, hey, this? I don't know. Closet. Pretty big closet. Big closet. Big walk-in closet. Mm -hmm. So anyway, um, we're gonna be wrapping this game up. Lots of fun. Lots of quality, especially in the. You guys should uh, buy it and play it. Especially in the second or revised edition, whichever the name is, because you get these cool little figurines. Uh, components are very Instead well put these. together. The game itself is nice. The board is awesome. Very easy to do. The way that they've got it set up for how the fire spreads between the four. Uh, I mean, this the D6 and the D8. Now, if you guys watch really our well. watch star. Other episodes, we're actually creating a game we are where we're game. using the same kind of dice. We are, but because we're going to have 48 states, it makes sense to have a, a D8 and a D6 and roll them. And what we're thinking is that one, the D8 will represent a zone, and the D6 will represent the state within the zone. Um, and it would be pretty cool, but we'll talk more about that on, a, on the designer sections of the Gamer's Den that will be coming to you soonish. Soonish? Is that even a word? It is now. Right, because they can't put anything on the internet that isn't true, right? Where have you heard that? On the internet. <laughs> and, and quite frankly, this will be on the internet, and it has to be true. <laughs> oh, yeah. I thought State Farm didn't have all the time. What did you hear about the internet? You the believe it. The internet. Yeah. You can't put anything on the internet. It's said true. And then, like, a woman, there's just a guy that's not even French model. He's like, hey, here's my other date. It's a French model. And then I'm on the internet. <laughs> Bonjour. <laughs> that commercial was funny. That commercial was so funny. It was pretty funny. And the sword blew up! Then she could have said, then she could have said, uh, je ne parle pas français, and he would have been totally lost because that guy was obviously not a French model. <laughs> Guys, look! Hey, look! I'm in fire! Anyway, ever. until next time, we'd like you to subscribe. We'd like you to follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. We'd like you to watch our other videos. Um, things like that, right? Anything else? Anything yep. else you want them to do? Mm, yeah. Subscribe to us. All that good stuff. Hey, maybe we'll do something cool. Like, maybe you should watch the rainbow. Or James gets a haircut. Or... Or, um... Or Falling Skies series. Falling Skies. Or our or Toronto we, Legacy. 
No, or, yeah, right? Trump swords, right? right? We have a, we have a Trump. We're, we're gonna put this up on your face. <laughs> and, then, and then on another video, we also have the designer. <laughs> no, down here. It's got me down here. <laughs> Nothing in front of this video, baby. <laughs> right here, guys. We're gonna look at the designer where we start talking about designing a board game, which is gonna be amazing when it's done. Maybe we'll even throw it in the Kickstart, give everybody a chance to help us out once we actually get it all together. Um, we also have, here's a playlist to, at least I hope I can put a playlist in. <laughs> I, might oh, only, guys. I might only be able to put a, a, a video, but that would be the reviews of season, the entire season three of Falling Skies. And there's just lots of other games like Super Munchkin, Pandem Zombies, Pandemic, Pandemic, or Pandemic, um, or whatever oh. I put it. <laughs> <laughs> whatever these old games are, I hear you. See, I'm touching them. See? <laughs> but you know what? We really want to thank you for watching our videos. We want to thank you for participating in our show. We love the comments. We love that you subscribe. We love that you follow us. And we're going to be bringing you more videos as we come along. Isn't that right? And we might even do cooler videos. Well, any video with us in it will be cool, hmm. right? We might even do a zoo video eventually. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I got maybe an idea. a Minecraft video as well. I got ideas. I do. Mm. Think, 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 think. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. No, that's kind of funny. We, seriously, we thank you for watching and tune in. Make sure you subscribe for our next events, things that are coming up. Until then, we say bye. Bye.